I don't know if you guys heard the news, but PewDiePie is coming to Facebook. Yes, PewDiePie, the biggest YouTuber on the planet, is finally creating content for Facebook. And in this video, we're gonna dive into his Facebook page and see why he decided to jump on the Facebook monetization train. Hey guys, my name is Lester Diaz, and in this channel, we talk about making money online, affiliate marketing, social media marketing, and everything in between. So if you're new, consider subscribing. So recently, it was announced that PewDiePie is coming to Facebook. Apparently, PewDiePie has been offered a lot of money, and he actually sees the potential in Facebook because there's a lot of people making money with Facebook gaming right now. So in this video, we're gonna take a look at some of the ways that you can make money as a Facebook gaming creator. As you guys know, PewDiePie, the biggest creator on YouTube with over 100 million subscribers, when you take a look at his Facebook page, I actually took the time to dive into his Facebook page and I noticed that he wasn't actually paying any attention at all to his Facebook following or even adding content. So I also want to show you that. I want to show you uh, what he's been doing over the past few years on his Facebook page and why that's about to change. So if you ask me, the main reason why PewDiePie decided to jump on Facebook is mainly because of this. Facebook gaming creators in 2020 earn over $50 million. In fact, there's over 2,000 gaming creators on Facebook right now who are making over $1,000 per month by live streaming on Facebook. That's mostly coming from the star system. This is uh, Facebook's way of monetizing live streaming on Facebook. But there's also multiple ways to monetize your gaming content on Facebook, like for example, the Facebook Instream ads. In order to qualify for Facebook Instream ads, all you gotta do is have over 10,000 followers on your Facebook page and your videos need to be over three minutes long. So once you reach that, Facebook will start showing ads on your three minute videos, meaning that you'll be able to make money from the advertising that's playing on your video. So PewDiePie will be able to make money not just from the live streaming, if he decides to do some live streaming, which I'm sure he will try to do, because given he has a massive following online, he can most likely make a few million dollars per year by simply live streaming on Facebook, maybe once a week. But according to the article, he's basically gonna be putting some of the content that he has on his YouTube channel and repurposing that content for Facebook, meaning that that content will be edited specifically for Facebook and he'll be able to monetize that content and make money from Facebook Instagram ads. Now, of course, you don't need to have a massive following like PewDiePie if you wanna make money from Facebook pages. I make money from Facebook pages. I have over 400 students who have made money from Facebook pages as well. And if you want to learn specifically how you can make money building and growing monetized Facebook pages, go ahead and check out Facebook Income School in the description below. It's gonna show you step by step what you need to do if you wanna build a Facebook monetized page. But if you want to learn more about how to actually live stream on Facebook and how uh, Facebook gaming creators make money, then you can go ahead and check out this video which will show you exactly the process and the multiple ways that you can monetize your content Content on Facebook. So guys, there's definitely a huge opportunity in 2021 for those of you who enjoy live streaming on Facebook, who are into creative gaming content. Of course, that means there's more competition, but there's always ways to go viral on Facebook. In fact, there's more ways to go viral on Facebook than they are on YouTube. It's far easier, in my opinion, to go viral on Facebook because Facebook already has the tools in place to help you go viral. Even using something like Facebook ads, by having a small advertising budget on a monthly basis, you can basically grow your following in a matter of just three months. You can grow to over 10,000, 20, 50,000 followers. You're investing into growing your audience because the more followers you have, the more views you can get on your live streams, and most likely the more views you'll get on your regular videos on your Facebook page. So this move by PewDiePie makes total sense, mainly because he knows he can probably make a lot of money. And I already talked about in some of my past videos how some of the creators are making over a million dollars per year just on Facebook ads alone. This past year, um, I made over a million on Facebook. And then once I really started to you know, dig into it and then I saw like the, the amount of money I was making and the viewership that was coming in, uh, Facebook is now the highest, you know, I, I make the most money in terms of monetizing directly from the platform. Take like a couple minute videos and combine it into a, one long three minute comp or 
I'll have a three minute video that I've been doing recently just for my IGTVs and just resurfacing them, putting them on Facebook. Because once you get the hang of what type of content is working on Facebook, specifically to your Facebook page, you can basically replicate and repose your content over and over again and make money from that content multiple times. So let's quickly dive into PewDiePie's Facebook page. Let's take a look at what he's been doing over the past few years and hopefully we can see uh, whether or not there's potential for PewDiePie to turn his Facebook page into another multi-million dollar business. So let's do that right now. So here we have PewDiePie's Facebook page and just by taking a quick look at it, you can tell that he's been ignoring his Facebook page for quite a while. He doesn't even have a cover image. Even though he has uh, close to 8.3 million people following his page, his last post was December 6, 2017. So he hasn't been posting on his Facebook page. Uh, he has millions of followers. This is only a small fraction of his total followers that he has on YouTube, but he basically hasn't posted on his Facebook page for quite a while, mainly because he probably believes that he couldn't make any money uh, from his Facebook page. So this is about to change. Of course, with this massive deal that PewDiePie made, he's about to basically take all his content, all his new content, and most likely he will start to live stream on Facebook as well, which will allow him to make a ton of money from this content. So later on this video, I'm gonna explain the uh, multiple ways that he'll be able to monetize his Facebook page. So you can see that this is something that you can also do yourself. You don't have to be PewDiePie if you wanna make a ton of money from Facebook pages. So let's take a look at the video section here. Uh, you can see that some of his videos were only about you know a few seconds long. This one, a minute and 28 seconds, four years ago, uh, four years ago, 591,000 views on this video. Uh, four years ago so he was definitely getting some good engagement but basically now if he wants to start making money from this content he needs to start posting you know three minute videos and his page um, has to be monetized and he probably has met all the requirements for monetization given that he has a massive following online I'm pretty sure he'll be able to get a few hundred million views per month from his Facebook page which means he can quickly get to a six figure monthly income from his Facebook page alone. So this is gonna add uh, most likely a few million dollars per year to his net worth, mainly by simply taking some of the content he already has on YouTube and repurposing that content for his Facebook page. So as you can clearly see, PewDiePie has been ignoring his Facebook page, but I'm sure that's about to change because given that he has this new deal, most likely, he was paid upfront to be able to put all his content on Facebook and at the same time, he'll be paying more attention to his content and growing his following. So even though on Facebook, he only has a small fraction of his total following. Keep in mind that on YouTube, he has over 100 million followers uh, on his YouTube channel. Uh, he only has about 7 million on his Facebook page, most likely as soon as he start posting uh, weekly content or daily content, depending on how fast he wants to grow, he'll be able to take that Facebook page perhaps to maybe 10, 20, 30 million followers within a few months. And this depends entirely on how well his team will actually repurpose that content because by simply just taking the video on YouTube and just uploading that same video on Facebook, that's not going to work. You have to make sure that the video fits the Facebook format because most people are used to watching 15, 20 minute videos on YouTube, but on Facebook, uh, you only have about three to five minutes to get someone's attention. And so people on Facebook are not used to watching very long videos. For that reason, it's best to stick to three to five minute videos that are designed to create engagement. Most likely, if you get more shares, that means that your videos has the potential of going viral, and that means more followers and more money in your pocket. So PewDiePie is gonna make money in multiple ways on his Facebook page. One is gonna be the Facebook star system, the second is gonna be Facebook Instagram ads, and the last one might be brand deals and companies that might pay him to basically uh, talk about a specific product or service on Facebook. So if they do this properly, I believe that PewDiePie over the next 12 months will be able to make far more money on Facebook than he's currently making from his YouTube channel. I know that's a bold statement, but I've seen people on Facebook make millions of dollars per year with one or two Facebook pages. And let's be honest, there's still a lot of people who don't know that they can monetize their videos on Facebook, and Facebook is still in the beginning stages of letting people know that now you can make money 
from your video. So I believe PewDiePie is only gonna be the beginning of getting some of the biggest YouTubers to jump also on Facebook because they'll be able to monetize their content and make even more money from their content. So with that said, I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, all I'm asking is that you hit the like button below. Also subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed already because I post videos like this every single week. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video.